One day, one, one day I, I, I was sitting on the cliff and um, wondering as an art, as a visual artist uh, what I would make in where I live in a beautiful place on the southeast um, coast of Ireland, a beautiful place called uh, the Copper Coast. I was looking, I was sitting on the cliff looking down trying to get inspiration for where I would make my uh, next art. A horse was led onto the, uh, onto the beach. Uh, by a trainer and um, he was led around on a lunge rope uh, around in circles and when I, as I looked down from the cliff uh, this beautiful circle was created by this horse around and around and around on a, on a, on a rope and I, I, I kind of thought you know if a horse can make that kind of a, an impact on the beach so can I. So from that day forward uh, like which is I suppose six or seven years ago now at this stage uh, I, uh, I decided that's it, I'm going to make uh, designs on beaches and uh, hence I um, have taken up sand art and you know making drawings with, uh, with a garden rake. So it's my second year to be here in uh, Spittle in Northumberland and uh, on the northeast coast of England and uh, close to the Scottish border. I'm so, I'm so honoured to be here. When I walk down on the beach, it's kind of like sometimes I, I kind of look I look at the uh, I look at the sand, I look at the sky, as well. Not that, that you might think that might have much difference, but I look at the sea. I'm aware of the tide, uh, but particularly I suppose the condition of the sand. And today in particular, um, we had a, a strangely beautiful piece of sand uh, which only involved um, raking over one time. So today's piece um, is dedicated to the RNLI. And the RNLI, I suppose, in Berwick and Spittle um, uh, have been here a long time. And, you know, there has been a campaign recently, as many of you will be aware, to keep uh, the RNLI here uh, in this area. I'd have to say that uh, in Spittle here has been fantastic for the last two years. Uh, the committee here have been brilliant. They've never told me I have to draw this or I have to draw that. Uh, there's been no major, uh, you know, corporate sponsors or logos that I have to draw like that. But this piece today that we drew, um, it's not just me, it was a collaborative piece. There was uh, between um, filmmakers and uh, families and kids and all the rest of it. We all dug a, at the end of me creating uh, a piece of sand art, we all dug a, a giant sand castle. And eventually the tide came around it and, uh, and all that was left was the, was the final uh, sandcastle and the uh, Northumberland flag on the sandcastle. So it, it, was, it was a nice poignant piece for the RNLI today. So I was very happy to uh, do that for the RNLI today. This, this is uh, just my second time uh, being at a festival in the UK. So I've traveled over from uh, Southern Ireland and uh, so delighted like, uh, to be invited back this year. It's uh, wonderful and I, I really would like to uh, uh, thank Mike Greener um, and um, Mo Watkins indeed and all the festival committee from the Spittle Seaside Festival that have me here in Northumberland. I would be so honoured to come back a third year if, if you'll have me. So thank you very much Spittle and Northumberland. Thank you.